My name is Mike Tuck. I'm a 13-year vet for the Sheffield Sharks. I was uh, born and raised in uh, Toronto, Canada and picked up a basketball probably around the age of 10. And from then on, it was, you know, this, this love affair with the sport. And from there, I realized that I wanted to go uh, down to the States and, and try and get an athletic scholarship. I ended up doing a, a post-grad year uh, at a prep school in Maine. From there, I got an athletic scholarship to uh, Loyola, Maryland. Played there for four years, had a great career there, and decided I wanted to, to head over to Europe. And I, I played in a few different places around Europe, uh, Cyprus, Luxembourg, France before I ended up uh, on, the, on the sunny shores of England. When I moved here, I didn't think I'd be here longer than a year or two, you know, maybe one season, maybe two seasons. That had ha was how my career had been going before that. Short stops in every country I'd been in. So, um, you know, for me, coming to Sheffield, Having immediate success, we won a cup my first season. Signed back to come back for my second season. We won another cup that season. So back-to-back -back cups just got me kind of addicted to silverware. And, and the chase for silverware was, was a lifelong career from there. Tuck from the top, got it! Mike Tuck is the new Sheffield Sharks leading all-time scorer. What an incredible moment for me in my career. Um, I never really thought I'd ever even get here, um, but just something really special that I'll, I'll always, I'll always remember, um, and that you know nobody can really ever take away from me, unless there's another guy who comes after me. You know, hopefully, you know, records are made to be broken. Me and Coach Atiba Lions I have a great relationship. You know, I've been here long enough that. He knows me, I know him. Uh, we, we trust each other. We're always very honest with each other, you know, and I think that's very important with a, with a coach and a player and a captain relationship. Top, top of the key, that's his shot. Knocks down the three. Mike Tuck stepping into that shot, he's not gonna miss too many of those. I mean, I'm an extremely blessed guy. I've, I've had so many amazing moments uh, throughout my career. Um, you know, definitely one that stands out to me right away is, is the 2016 BBL Playoff Finals. Wow! Tough play. Beautiful, beautiful touch up the fingers. You know, I ended up having a huge game and, and taking home MVP and, and, and a big win. Uh, you know, my mother had flown over from Canada and I had a bunch of family in the crowd, so huge moment for me. Another moment that sticks out to me is being named captain of, of Team England at the 2018 Commonwealth Games and uh, having the opportunity to go head to head against, you know, my former teammate, Kieran Achara, when we played England versus Scotland, you know, something special that I'll always remember. There's been a lot of things that have changed uh, in the BBL over the years, but everything for, for the good. When I first got here, the league was strong and, and there was lots of talent, but I think the league has definitely upped their game in terms of talent-wise. I think that teams moving into their own venues is, is, has been a huge thing and has had a huge effect on the league. And I think that we'll see, continue to see that trend throughout the league, which will help strengthen you know, the brand of the league as a whole. And then obviously the new investment coming in is exciting right now. So I've always called myself Yorkshire's adopted son. I think that I've been here long enough now that I'm not just an honorary Sheffielder. I'm the real deal. I'm a Sheffielder now, for sure. There's a popular sports bar within Sheffield, and uh, they've actually asked to have one of my jerseys put up within within the, the sports bar. So, you know, for me, that's a pretty special moment. You know, it's, it's up there with a, a bunch of my other achievements, but to, to come into a, a pub and, or a bar and, and see your name or your jersey up on the wall is pretty special.